The same people who say no maulid, no innovations in Islam, they have a very bad belief about Allah. We know that God is unique. He doesn't have a form. He cannot be imagined. This is our belief of the Muslims. Unicity of Allah. Those people who say no maulid, no innovation, take the Quran in the apparent meaning, don't do any interpretation. They believe that Allah is a body. How can the creator of bodies have a body? This is impossible. This is not the belief of the Prophet, not the belief in the Quran, not the belief of the companions and the scholars till our day. This is their belief of Wahhabism. Allah says in Surah Al-Ikhlas, which means, Say, O Muhammad, God is unique, Al-Ahad. How can one be unique if he has body parts to sit on the throne? This is their belief. No interpretation. They just want to take the apparent meaning. No, it doesn't work. This makes according to them that there is contradictions in the Quran. Because God says that he is unique. Nobody can reach his reality. But they say, no, you have to take the apparent meaning. It means that he sits on the throne. No, the scholars said the most, merci the most merciful dominates the throne. Because in Arabic, the word istawa can mean sitting or it can mean dominate. Those people, they say, God, he sits on the throne. But the real Muslims, they say, God dominates the throne. We don't, our belief don't have any contradiction, contradiction with the Quran or the Hadith. So, even in the belief, those Wahhabis, they are not on the right place. So when they say, no Mawlid, I'm not going to listen to them. They don't even know who is Allah.